Welcome to Purring Loaf. Are you ready to unlock the secrets of your cat's purring behavior? In this video, we will explore the physical, biological, and emotional significance of cat purring. So, grab your cat and join us as we uncover the mysteries of feline communication. Are you ready to dive into the mysterious world of cat purring? Well, you've come to the right place. In this segment, we're going to introduce you to the basics of cat purring and what makes it such a unique and fascinating behavior. First things first, let's talk about the physical aspect of purring. Cats have a unique skeletal and muscular structure that allows them to purr, and it's controlled by the central nervous system. But here's the kicker, not all cats can purr. So, next time you hear your cat purring, remember it's a special ability that not all cats possess. But that's not all, cat purring is not just a physical act, it's also a behavioral and emotional one. Cats purr in a variety of situations, from contentment to stress and pain. In the next segments, we will take a closer look at the different types of purring and their meanings, so you can better understand your feline friend. So, get ready to discover the fascinating world of cat purring and how it shapes the way cats think, feel, and interact with their environment. You might be surprised to learn that purring isn't just a sign of contentment, it's actually a complex biological process. Cats have a unique skeletal and muscular structure that allows them to purr, and it's controlled by the central nervous system. But that's not all. Purring also has some amazing healing powers. Studies have shown that the vibrations produced by purring can help to promote healing of bones and muscles, reduce pain and inflammation and even lower stress levels. So, the next time you hear your cat purring, remember it's not just a sign of relaxation, it's also a sign of a well-oiled purr machine at work. Get ready to discover the fascinating world of cat purring and how it shapes the way cats think, feel and interact with their environment. So, grab your cat, sit back, and let's learn together about the mysterious world of cat purring. In this segment, we're going to take a closer look at the behavioral and emotional significance of cat purring. As we previously discussed, cats have a unique skeletal and muscular structure that allows them to purr, and it's controlled by the central nervous system. But it's not just about the physical aspect. Cats purring also has a lot to do with their behavior and emotions. We know that cats purr when they are happy and content, but they also purr in other situations such as when they are stressed or in pain. The purring can be a sign of pain or distress, in such cases it will be a low-frequency, rumbling purr. However, purring can also serve as a form of communication between cats and their human caregivers. Studies have shown that cats will purr more in the presence of their human caregivers as a way to bond and establish a sense of security. So, as you can see, cats purring is not just a simple act but it has a lot of meanings and significance. It is important for us to understand the different purring behaviors of cats so we can understand their emotional state and help them better. In this segment, we're going to take a closer look at the behavioral and emotional significance of cat purring. As we previously discussed, cats have a unique skeletal and muscular structure that allows them to purr, and it's controlled by the central nervous system. But it's not just about the physical aspect. Cats purring also has a lot to do with their behavior and emotions. We know that cats purr when they are happy and content, but they also purr in other situations such as when they are stressed or in pain. The purring can be a sign of pain or distress, in such cases it will be a low-frequency, rumbling purr. However, purring can also serve as a form of communication between cats and their human caregivers. Studies have shown that cats will purr more in the presence of their human caregivers as a way to bond and establish a sense of security. So, as you can see, cats purring is not just a simple act, but it has a lot of meanings and significance. It is important for us to understand the different purring behaviors of cats, so we can understand their emotional state and help them better. In this segment, we're going to explore the different types of cat purring and how to interpret and respond to them. First, let's talk about the happy purr. This is the purr you're probably most familiar with, the one your cat makes when they're curled up next to you and content. It's a low-frequency, steady purr that sounds like a soothing hum. Next, we have the distress purr. This is a low-frequency, rumbling purr that cats make when they're in pain or feeling stressed. 
It's important to pay attention to this type of purring and take action if you think your cat may be in distress. And finally, we have the solicitous purr. This is a high-frequency, rapid purr that cats make when they want something, like food or attention. It's often accompanied by other behaviors, such as rubbing against you or meowing. So, now that you know the different types of cat purring, you'll be able to better understand your feline friend's emotional state and respond accordingly. Whether it's providing extra cuddles or making sure they have enough food and water, you'll be able to take better care of your cat by understanding the nuances of their purring behavior. In this video, we delved into the physical, biological, and emotional significance of cat purring and how to interpret different types of purring and respond accordingly. Thanks for tuning in, you'll be able to better understand your feline friend's emotional state and strengthen your bond with your cat now. Thanks for watching, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel for more cat-themed videos. We have more feline-related content coming up, so stay tuned for more cat behavior and communication insights.